All right, so teams getting into position here for semi-final number two. Rockhampton Grimmer in red and black and uh, the Cathedral College in their predominantly blue with white trimmings. It'll be Rockhampton Grammar to kick off, running from right to left of screen. Semi-final number two of the Dolphins Cup. Who will play St. Brendan's in the grand final? We're about to find out, and here we go. We have liftoff. The Cathedral College to bring it back here. Off the back fence, as they say. Any support here for Rockhampton Grammar. Cathedral College. TCC is there affectionately known. 25 out from their own line here. Early exchanges. Temperature just starting to drop a little bit at Rugby Park. So there's Jaden Savage, the prop forward. Last tackle. Kick just outside the 40, off the side of the boot. Right, it's going to bounce in the field of play and kept in. No, the touchy's flag was in the air. Well, hang on a second. I thought I saw the touchy's flag in the air. We're continuing play here. Rockhampton Grammar with the football. Number seven there, just getting in dummy half. That's Callum Denman. As we mentioned, Rockhampton Grammar, 20 points to six. They defeated TCC in the regular season of the Dolphin Cup. It was the Cathedral College's only loss, and it came the way of Rockhampton Grammar, who have the ball now through Noah Cody. So Cody the play at last tackle now for Rockhampton Grammar. And they're kicked two off the side of the boot. And this time taken by TCC at the back. And it looks like it's the fullback in Matty Marjoram. TCC Armstrong. Jake Armstrong. Good shape early on in their attack, TCC. Inside Rocky Grammar territory to be played by the number five there in Hayden Baker and oh boy giving away a penalty Rockhampton Grammar very late in the set of six on that occasion and penalty kick taken and, uh, looks like we're still waiting for the ball here here it comes Still nil all the score. Both sides looking for first points. A couple of false starts here. 30 minute halves. Dolphins Cup footy. Here we go. It's the uh, rangy number 12 in Alakisio Siali. He's a danger man on that left side, Siali. And now Ethan Little. Again, got some really good shape here in their attack, don't they, TCC? Coomba, a 5'8", Jake Coomba, Elijah Mackay. Head by Billy Barron. And now, the number 10, have support at the line, Little, and Ethan Little, some heavy contact on him as Rockhampton Grammar get around each other here. So huge defensive play by Rockhampton Grammar. Still nil all the score. Here at Rugby Park. There's 
from Hampton Grammar work it away. And some of the notable people from each respective school. Northampton Grammar, Ben Condon, who's played uh, in the North Queensland Cowboys uh, NRL system. As we see an error, this time from Rockhampton Grammar. Alexander Bolonagoff, the Olympic rower. Quite a number of politicians went to Rockhampton Grammar. As for TCC, Dan Russell, Papua New Guinea Rugby League International. Also, also Kobe Hetherington went to Rockhampton Grammar. Of course, plays for the Brisbane Broncos. I believe the son of Jason Hetherington, the former Canterbury Bankstown Bulldog. Here they go, TCC now. Now all the score looking to break through Rockhampton. Grammar haven't had the best of the territory. Find themselves defending here their try line. TCC, here they come out the back. Here's uh, the number five in Baker fending away. Miracle ball on the inside. Intercepted by Rockhampton. Grammar. Touch his flag was in the air. And good hustle from the Rockhampton Grammar schoolboys defenders. Baker was looking lively. I thought they might pick out Siali there, TCC, on that side. It's one of the biggest players on the field. They can get the ball to Alakisio Siali, the number 12. He could do some damage. There's a tough one. Well taken, Rockhampton Grammar. Gee, tough pass. Five out from your own line. And they live to see another day here. Must try and get to their kick, Rockhampton Grammar. Here's Henry Corquist. Starting to make a name for themselves, Rocky Grammar. In rugby league, schoolboys football. And a chance for their first Dolphins Cup grand final. There's an early kick inside the 40, not a bad ploy. And all the way back there, Isaac Dala. What's on a little bit of a goose step, Dala. But that's not a bad outcome there for Rockhampton Grammar. The early kick and they're playing football up where they want to be playing football and where they want their opponents more importantly. Tackle there by Riley Sullivan, the little number nine. Here's Siali for TCC. Have a look at him go. And he even got the offload away, but the ball's hit the deck. Siali, he wants the referee to make a call in their favour, but knock on the call here. So now it's Rockhampton Grammar's turn for ball in their opposition's half of the, of the field. Nil all the score, just over eight minutes gone. The winner of this one to play St. Brendan's in the 2024 Dolphin Cup Grand Final. Of course, you'll catch that Grand Final right here on Community TV. Overlap there, Rockhampton Grimmer. Justin Sharps was unmarked. They couldn't get him the ball. Here's Xavier Knott. Rockhampton Grammar. The Kookaburra is getting vocal at this time of day. Locally. Corquist. 25 metres out, Rockhampton Grammar. Let's see what they've got in attack. Callum Denman on now to the number four. The pass was touched. Is it six more? And there's cleaning up there is Justin Sharps. It comes in. Oh, well taken. Penalty for contact. Wasn't a lot in it. Matty Marjoram did well.
McCoy. Just a little bit, uh, a bit of ill discipline there. Penalty TCC. And a little bit of urgency there, too quick for the officials. Elijah Mackay. Jaden Savage. Looking for Siali. Here he is, Siali, inside the 10. Thought about the offload. Seven metres out, looking for first points. Savage. Jaden Savage for Captain Grimmer. Player not in the defensive line in the back play there. It's their hooker. And now Mickey Busby. Riley Sullivan very slow to get back in the defensive line. TCC. It'll be a changeover, but gee, they went close. Somehow Rockhampton Grammar managing to hang on. Here's a half break. Cormac Werner. Plenty of headgears in this Rockhampton Grammar side. Plenty of different coloured headgears as well. And again, they'll kick. Just beyond the 30, it's a wonderful kick. A thumping kick, and it would have been a 40-20. And, in fact, the touch has got their flag in the air. We take another look at that kick. It was an absolute beauty, well and truly inside the 40s. We take a look at this here. And the touchy with the flag in the air, well... Touchy in a much better position, but uh, certainly TCC, they thought that that was play on and there wasn't a lot in it. Here's a chance, Rockhampton, Grammar, they're over! Henry Conquest! And have a look at him celebrate. Rockhampton, Grammar, they strike first, they've absorbed a lot of pressure. And the front rower, Henry Corquist with the opening try. Rockhampton, Grammar lead. At the back of that 40-20 call. And Rockhampton, Grammar making it count. Callum Denman, the halfback with the kicking duties for Rockhampton Grammar. <laughs> Left footer. And he adds the extras only just. <laughs> It's a strong thumping kick, though. Got a good boot on him. Six points to nil. Rockhampton Grammar leading TCC. So ready to go again here. Okay. 
Hampton Grammar. Have a look at this run. Each run there. You've got plenty of support. Plenty of vocal support. And now, well read there. Two in the tackle. Jake Armstrong and also Isaac Dahla. And they even take the player into touch. So well defended. Nowhere to go. And that's... Uh, just one of those plays that can get the whole team going defensively for TCC. So TCC now. Here's Siali. Got a knock on. So knock on here. Had a full set coming up there to TCC. Noah after the scrum. Noah. Noah. After the scrum. So, let off there. Rockhampton Grammar, they lead six points to nil. And the ball comes loose again. We'll see a penalty though this time. Penalty. So Rockhampton Grammar looking for another one here. And Siali just starting to really assert his physical presence. So Rockhampton Grammar, that's Max Clark who's on the puck. Here they come, early kick, the chase here. Oh, it was a horrible bounce. All he needed was a kind bounce. He was going to score for all money there. The number four for Rockhampton Grammar. And oh boy, that was the only thing that was going to save TCC. And the ball bouncing right on the point of the football. Got a horrible bounce. And TCC somehow survived. Henry, 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 Here you go, mate. That's the number four, that's Leo Fanuatanu. So six points to nil. On Campton Grammar lead, TCC. This low scoring affair, and then Venom in the tackles from both sides. And that's good contact from Fanua Tanu. TCC worked their way towards the 40 meter line, played there by Jake Armstrong. And now Elijah Mackay. And the kick, a bit of contact after the kick. And play on it is. No, here comes the penalty. I suspect that's for the contact on the kicker. As we approach the 20 minute mark. 30 minute halves, TCC. They've got a chance to attack here inside their position 20. Tap and go by Jake Armstrong. So here they come, Parker Gallagher. Oh boy. 
Parker Gallagher it was. As we take another look at this. Man, just couldn't handle. Just could not handle. Well, that's disappointing for them, isn't it? Because it's just a regulation play, wasn't it? And completions up this NTCC. It'll be desired. Six nil Rockhampton Grammar League TCC just repeating. They met in the regular season and that was a win to Rockhampton Grammar. 20 points to six. The only loss of TCC's campaign in the Dolphin Cup for 2024. Out the back they come. Solid shot there, particularly for a centre, Elijah Mackay. Compton Grammar. Kick comes in, this time it's Bronson Carlos. And fielded there by Hayden Baker for TCC. Defence is ready and waiting. Broadhurst on that right edge with one little keeper alive. Oh boy. Some real fierce defense, and it was a winger coming up with this tackle. Cormac Werner. So TCC, this is better. Penalty. So a momentum shift perhaps. Siali again. Alakisio Siali. And now, oh! What about that for an absolute bow rattler? Huge shot there from Henry Corquist on Epa Falasi Noah, who's just come onto the field. Welcome to the ball game. And here's Noah again. Credit to him, Epa, Epa Falasi Noah. He goes again, unfazed. Cooper Taylor also on the field for TCC. Quick play the ball. They have it. Chance their hand here. Parker Gallagher from Dummy Half. They're claiming the try. And no try but a penalty to TCC. Comes Noah again. Have a look at him go. Epifalasi Noah. Try and stop me, he says. That was Jake Coomba. And now Mackay's had a good game. Tries his chances with a little kick. I think he might have been hurt there, Callum Denman. What's the ruling going to be here? Is it going to be a knock-on against Rockhampton Grammar? That's the question. It will be a TCC scrum feed. So there you go, knock-on against Denman. Just over five minutes to go in the first half. TCC, Marjoram, the fullback. Inside the 10, they got a chance here to the left. Siali's on that side. They come towards the middle of the park. No 
That's where Noah's getting ready on the right edge. Back towards Siali's side. Dummy to him on the inside. Marjoram out the back. The winger gets past one. That's Baker. And six more ruled here, is it? Uh, Tackle count to restart. So there must have been a Rockhampton grammar hand in all that. Jake Kumba. And not on TCC. So a little bit sloppy TCC. They just keep completing their sets and giving themselves the best chance possible. Six points to nil. Hampton Grammar leading Cathedral College. Probably wouldn't be too... They probably wouldn't uh, mind going in 6-0 in front of Hampton Grammar. They wouldn't be too put off by just taking a six-point lead at this stage. You would think they've had to do a lot of defending off their own try line and they might even think about an early kick here too Callum Denman here's Max Clark this is Callum Denman here he is, here comes the kick it's high, have a look at the chase here from Vanua Tanu there's that Dala at the back been the better side, Rockhampton Grammar, with their kick chase today, thus far. Six nil they lead. Can TCC come up with some points before half time? Siali. Alakesi O Siali. Siali. Still going, Siali. I think they got the short side here. Mm, yes, they do. And there's the kick. And a watchful fullback. And uh, gee, oh boy, there's players there that have just ended up into the crowd. Members of the crowd watching right on the dead ball line, and uh, gee, they almost got taken out. So just over two minutes to play here in the first half. 6 0 Rockhampton Grammar. First half, oh, this could be costly for TCC. A fine touch. So, still time for one more try. This is Cooper Broadhurst for Rockhampton Grammar. Bronson Carlos. They wanted a penalty from the marker going early. They didn't get it, Rockhampton Grammar. And now Demon, Callum Demon, that is, the halfback, as he distributes. Played here by the try scorer, Henry Corkus. The only try of the game, number 16. Only 10 out centre of the field. Denman, beautiful pass and lovely step inside Leo Fanuatanu. They've got their second Rockhampton grammar. Fanuatanu scores. And that one has got to hurt right before half time. Penalty conceded. And Rockhampton grammar able to convert. 
Try to Leo Fanua Tanu. He had work to do. It was a lovely pass. 10 0 kick to come. There's the siren. Callum Denman. Line this one up about 18 from touch. He's taken it 22 metres back. Left footer. And here he goes. Callum Denman, he know he know he gives gives it a good dump. He might have to start this one slightly left. Oh, oh, just put it across the face. See, that was close as well. Both kicks have been close. Half time, semi final number two, Rockhampton Grammar 10, leading TCC nil. Stay with us because we've got the second half coming up right after this. 10 points nil at the break. Rockhampton Grammar lead the Cathedral College be kicking off to start this second half great to have you with us here on community tv the dolphin cup it looks like we're just waiting for the officials So the referee making his way to his position on halfway for the second half of semi-final number two. TCC to kick off. And here we go. Campton Grammar. They lead 10-0 and they've got the football in hand. Half an hour to play. This is Schoolboys Rugby League, and this captures the Queensland area of Rockhampton and Lacoon. Central Queensland Nursery. It does officially belong to the Dolphins NRL side. Here's the kick from Rockhampton Grammar. They're not afraid to kick early, are they? Hayden Baker. Looks like he's going to lose his jersey. Have to find the football in all that rabble. Pop his jersey back on. A slight wardrobe malfunction. <laughs> So Hayden Baker to play it. And that's tackle number one, nine short of halfway. <laughs> Bouncing out of tackles there was Cooper Taylor. And there's a player in trouble here for Rockhampton Grammar. I think he might have to leave the field. Hopefully he's okay. Yeah, 
Good to see he's in the hands of trainers. And again, let's hope he's okay, the young fella. Now, 10 points to nil. Play about to resume. He played here by Cooper Taylor, it is. Oh, more heavy contact. They're bringing the heat both sides. And again, that was Uncle Falasi Noah. And another big pop up from one to another, Elikisio Siali. And there's another player down, goodness gracious. You see the player in backfield there, just to the ground. Here he is, that's, uh, again, hope that he's okay. Canton Grammar, they lead 10-0. They finished the regular season 2-2. Two two. TCC, they were 3-1. and Just that one loss did come to Rockhampton Grammar in round 2. 20 points to 6. They lead TCC so far again today. 10 points to nil. It is still plenty of time. Some encouraging signs there for the welfare of the player involved there and just getting some attention so hopefully there's some good signs there's a touchy will take her position again referee's ready to blow time on and here we go three stoppages to this set and finally there's a kick at the end of it and taken in the in goal area by Mason Broadhurst so Seven tackles, seven. again the defence, strong as ever. There's plenty of muscling up from both these teams here today. Ten points to nil. TCC. Still searching for their first points. Of course, a date with St. Brendan's Yukon in the grand final awaits for the winner of this one. Gee, flying through. And flying through there for Northampton Grimm. It might have been Leo Fanuatanu. It looks spectacular. He didn't come away with any of the ball. And after all that, it's a penalty going the way of Rockhampton Grammar. Get up, get up. The touch. And back in the middle, ready to go again. Oh, Campton Grammar. Looking to extend their lead with a valuable try here. In the box seat. Ten metres away. Callum Denman. And now Morrison. It's Joseph Morrison. Cooper Broadhurst. Back towards the middle. Riley Sullivan via Denman. 
here's Cook. Uh, rather, it's uh, trying to just get a look here. It's number 13, that's not. Demon again. Full back, Mason Broadhurst. Through the hands. Fanua Tanu. And in the corner, it's try time, is it? No, great defence from TCC playing for their season. And so Rockhampton Grammar looked destined to score. Perhaps a little too unselfish there from Fanua Tanu. Not close to the line. Limited space to work with. Perhaps he should have just gone himself. But trying to do the right thing and TCC able to do what was required there defensively. Ten points to nil. Oh, there's a knock on out of nowhere. No one around him. Parker Gallagher, that one's going to hurt. And they'll have to defend again here, TCC. TCC. A real grueling contest. Quick hands again out to the Justin Sharps wing. And again, same result. TCC read it well. TCC. They're still in the contest. They won't go away. They're hanging on by a thread, but they're still hanging on, TCC. Ethan Little. Seven and three quarter minutes gone in this second half, and Little calling for some attention. That left arm, penalty TCC. Come on, let's react! React! Oh, turn, turn, get ready, be quick. So here he goes again. Alakisio Siali. See, they'd love to get him some ball, early ball close to the try line, wouldn't they? Slow play the ball. Joseph Morrison all over him. No penalty. Play on. Nicky Busby. The seven. Billy Barron. And now, here he is again. Epifalasi Noah. Just keeps on keeping on. The big fella. Solid contact there. Gallagher. Ten away, short side by Jake Coomba. They're going to play the ball here. They're going to award the try. They're going to award the try. So TCC respond, and they're right in this one. Let's take another look at that. Nothing wrong with it, says the referee. What a try. So 10 points to four, kick to come. TCC, and they do get the first try of the second half.
So big kick coming up here. And finally on the scoreboard, TCC. This kick. Five in from touch. 23 out. It's a high kick. It's very high, but it's also very straight. So that's absolute beauty. Ten points to six. It's a four-point game. So TCC now. And here's Noah. Look for Lassie Noah. We've got a game on our hands here, folks. Great to have you with us on Community TV. Of course, the winner of this one to play St. Brendan's in the 2024 Dolphin Cup Grand Final, which you'll also catch on Community TV. Strong run there. Elijah Mackay, he's been impressive tonight. And the wrong pepped into Rockhampton Bremer territory. Go TCC. out. That's Parker Gallagher. So 30 out on the last. Will they go for an attacking kick or they try and pin their opponents right on their try line. And it's a high one. It's a little bit too deep. Oh, there's a fumble in the end. Goal, so it's going to work out okay. Well, well, well. Perhaps a little bit of nerves there at the back. Starting to creep in for Rockhampton Grammar. In this game, he's taking on a different complexion now. High drop out. And Noah. Bullocking run. Epifalasi Noah. Really lifting his side tonight. There's Matty Marjoram, the fullback. Remarkably, they could take the lead here. TCC, Cruz, Beasley. Inside the 10. Noah was there. They come back to uh, Busby, it was. In the hands. Busby again. Noah. Last tackle. Take ten. Take ten. There we go to Busby. Out of side. Inside pass at pace. Oh, great effort there by Henry Paulquist. He's got enough contact around the legs on a rampaging Elijah Mackay, I think it was. He doesn't shy away, does he? But Rockhampton Grammar just doing enough defensively. out of their own end. Campton Grammar. Defence there. Elijah Mackay in the tackle. One side. Kimba, and now they're away here, Rockhampton Grammar. But, uh, Justin Sharps. Good meters at the back end of that set as they go high. Look at this line of chases. They really are a team in cohesion, Rockhampton Grammar. Win, lose, or draw. A very united front whole team. certainly put themselves in a position to stare at, snare a grand final berth. They're up by four. 15 minutes to play. Slow play the ball. Oh, he 
Here's a break. TCC. Busby. Holds his forward there. Is it? The ball goes backwards. There's the run there from Cooper Taylor originally. Last play. We've got a uh, little kick, it goes in behind from Harley Biles. And uh, Mason Broadhurst is there to retrieve possession for Rockhampton Grammar. Ten points to six. Just the one try in the second half. Leo Fanuatanu. It's been a gruelling, gritty, hard-fought battle out there between these two schools. The game well and truly on the line. As every second ticks by, it gets closer and closer to a next try wins scenario as the fullback allows it to bounce. Justin Sharps is there. He has to play it at the end as Matty Marjoram. And the locals love that one. Justin Sharps, persistence paying off. And a line dropout coming up. And Sharpie cries. An acknowledgement of the effort there from Justin Sharps. Shoulder charge was the lock forward Cruz Beasley. A little too far out, but I wonder if they're thinking about the two here. They won't take the two. But points to six. Fanuatanu. Well, Campton Grammar, a try here would really hurt TCC. There's a knock on, surely. And Bronson Carlos there. It is a pressure game, of course. and Big game for these young boys. It's a real tussle, of course, for a grand final berth. It would be the first grand final for Rockhampton Grammar. TCC have tasted a lot of uh, success at Aaron Payne Cup level and in the past. And they'd love to make a grand final too. Six Rockhampton Grammar lead over TCC as we approach the final 10 minutes. Now that was not back off Rockhampton Grammar, was it? No. Have a look at that one. The pass there just being forced and perhaps it did go forward. Referee in the best position. So scrum win, the TCC. Didn't well to score the only try of the second half, but they must be the team to score the next one. If they can, they might just book a ticket to the grand final. Here's Elijah Mackay. 
Got Rockhampton Grammar on the back foot here. Nine and a half to play. They trail by four. The Cathedral College, here they come. Cooper Taylor. Taylor plays at 21 away. Dancing out of tackles here. It looks like it's Jake Coomer, the 5'8", it is. And from dummy half, Billy Barron! Offload away. Oh, Coomer, too hot to handle. Penalty. Penalty to TCC. This is a huge call. Take their time here, TCC. Take 10. This could be the game right here. Still a lot of time, mind you. Cooper Taylor, a metre away. The Cathedral College. Busby on the inside looking for runners. Mackay, he'll always put his hand up. Elijah Mackay, still going. Claiming the try, Mackay. I think the referee might say he was held. Perhaps just short of the line. That came off a Rockhampton Grammar player. Play on. The call. Restart the tackle count. Doesn't appear to be so. Still TC C ball. Beasley plays it. And now Bales. Harley Bales. Look at Siali lining up here on the left. Slow play the ball. And there's the short pass. TCC claiming the try there is Parker Gallagher. Knock on, says the referee. Gallagher ruled to have lost it. Well, Parker Gallagher was over the try line. They've been resilient. Campton Grammar on their own line. His last few passages of play. Ten points to six. They lead. All of their ten points being scored in the first half. Bruising defence. Out for the battle, TCC. Tackle made by Jake Armstrong on that occasion. And oh boy, look at Rockhampton Grammar getting driven back. Led by Siali. TCC are fired up at the moment. They might think about an early kick here, but perhaps not only on their own 20. No, here it comes. So, not the worst result. Really not the worst result at all. And particularly not the worst result because they might cut the football here, touch his flags in the air. Well, how about that? The early kick has come up trumps. What a play. It's been a masterstroke. Gee, TCC made that look awfully difficult. Rockhampton grammar. Kicks only as good as the chase, and they were there in numbers. Hampton Grammar a chance here to really solidify their position with more points as time continues to tick down. Ten points to six, approaching the final five minutes. Winner goes through the grand final. Oh, Campton Grammar, Cooper Broadhurst. Might be thinking about the repeat set here as well. There's Brody Pigeon. Oh, he wrestled strongly to the ground. And now the kick here from Denman. And they've got a penalty to lock in to Grimm. And now they might think about the two. They can kick an easy two here and then work their way towards a field goal. Defending a six-point lead instead of a four. 
Well, it's not exactly an easy two. I take that back, but they may just think about the two. And they will take the two. Also, the elder takes some time off the clock as well in the process. Get ready, get ready. Big kick coming up. Callum Denman, he's one from two today. We know he doesn't die wondering with his conversions. He'll look to kick this out of the stadium. Massive kick. 13 in from touch. 20 metres out. He might be left and he's missed it. Now, in importantly, it did go dead, did it? Yes. They might look for the early kick here, TCC. to find touch or look to go the short 10 well they've just handed it back to their opposition okay well there is still time but, uh, certainly on attack and kick to try and regain possession that one so Rockhampton Grammar have it just over two and a half to play here a try well and truly would seal the game Henry Corquist. Clark. Cooper Broadhurst. Last tackle. Kick for the corner. Going back off TCC, then back off Rockhampton Grammar. And it could be play on here, it is. So they've got two minutes here, TCC, to score. Two minutes to book a ticket to the grand final. Otherwise, it would be Rockhampton Grammar, the face of Brendan's Yapoon. They'll have to go 80 metres as it stands. Early ball out the back, and here they go, TCC. And he's left it behind him, Aiden Baker. His flag in the air. the siren and that's it Rockhampton Grammar they're through to the grand final 10 points to 6 they've defeated the Cathedral College 10-6 Rockhampton Grammar over the Cathedral College 10 points to 6 they're through to their first ever Dolphins Cup grand final to face St Brendan's College Yapoon Rockhampton Grammar 10 defeating TCC 6 what a performance